guys, I've got another uh, video for you. This is the uh, 2011 Land Rover LR4. Uh, I've got a code on the dash. Um, uh, it's a warning, I guess, that says um, the hood latch is open. Uh, I checked it. The actual part is broke. So I'm going to show you how to replace that. And... Uh, Hopefully that'll be pretty quick. Uh, let's get right into it. Okay guys, this is the broken part. Um, that's what it looks like. It plugs in. Um, I'm just gonna, I've already took it off. I'm just going to show you how, where it went here. Um, if you can see that. But it goes up underneath this latch and then it presses down. tells the computer that the... Um, Hood is closed, and it's um, got a plug in here. I've already unplugged that, and let me show you my fix to get by till um, I got my part in the mail. I've got it taped over here. Here's the wire that plugs into the part, and I've basically just got this. Um, let me get the tape off. Okay guys, as it comes up here, you're going to see that there's two wires just shoved in here. And I've got it taped up, and that is just telling it that the hood is closed. Until I can get my part. Okay, it came in a pretty small box, and this is the new part. And it looks pretty much the same. It plugs in. Uh, I thought at first it might be, uh, <laughs> there's no way this could be it, but it's just in a really tiny box. So I'm going to try to uh, put this on where you can see it. Okay, I'm coming up underneath the bottom. Here's my fingers. And I'm just going to try to press it in carefully. It just goes up underneath this uh, Kind of sticks out the front here. That little piece. Let me see. Let me check it here. Okay, it is super hard to see. There's this part here kind of sticks out the front, and then the little. See, it's broke completely off here that was sticking on the front on this part. And these little pieces here, uh, getting the groove of the hole here. And I guess if this front piece breaks off um, over time right here, then that's what makes it quit working. And the hood shut, it just pushes the whole thing down. Um, it doesn't read anymore. Here's the, um, here's the plug. <laughs> I can't see it either. I'm just going to plug it back in. See if I can get a click. Click. There it goes. So it should work now. I took my, my wire off and uh, got my old part. I'm going to uh, shoot the hood and see if it is fixed. Start her up. <laughs> Coolant level low. Check spare tire pressure. And that's it. Which in this case, that means it is good. I've still got to do the uh, coolant level low fix. I'll do that on another video. But uh, it did say that uh, hood latch open. And you can clear your coach with OK. So it's working. That's cool. I wonder if I pop the hatch, if it would say it was watch running okay hood open 
so press OK to clear. So that's what the code did say, and I've just popped the hack, so so it is working correctly now. Okay, guys. Well, that was just a quick little video to show you how to fix this uh, hood latch problem. You just got to get another part. I'll try to uh, get that part uh, number uh, put in the description box. Uh, that's all there is to it. Uh, it pretty much just breaks off. You got to take it off and snap another one in, and uh, it'll work. And, uh, so you can uh, trick it with a piece of wire. Push the nose, that plug, and uh, some people say they used a paper clip, uh, taped it up until uh, uh, they can get the part. Uh, you don't have the things in the hoods open all the time. Of course, you got to check the hood and make sure that it's actually locked. Uh, but, uh, anyway, I hope you like the video, and I'll see you in the next one.